I'm Mark Beaumont and uh, I'm here with David Fox Pitt from Wild Fox Events on the banks of Loch Tay in Perthshire at the heart of Scotland. It's also pretty close to where I live and train for all my, my big expeditions. So this is, uh, in my opinion, some of the best, best training grounds, some of the best wilderness we've got in Scotland. The reason to be here today is specifically to do some training for some events that I've committed to do with Wild Fox this year. Wild Fox run a whole number of events, about eight events throughout the year and uh, the big charity events, different causes with each and uh, well I've committed this year to do at least a couple of them and it's pretty exciting off the back of the big expeditions I've done in the last year to come back and test myself on some of the challenges that David's got lined up. I mean David, how, how did this all happen for you and uh, you know what's this year looking like? Well we started about uh, 14 years ago um, I'm based um, at Loch Tay here and it's really to inspire people. Um, the, the great thing about our events is anybody can do them. Um, and in the other events, you've got different mileage levels so people can come in at a sort of family walk to the full uh, challenging distance. But the most important thing and the reason for setting up uh, Wild Fox events was to promote charity. So every event has to raise money for nominated charity. In terms of the charities, talk a little bit about who's involved and, and what good that's done over the years of the event. Well, we've raised actually close to 30 million pounds since we started for a whole host of charities. And sometimes the events will change uh, every three years. Some events we do for a nominated charity throughout. Um, and, um, and we're all speaking to different charities. But yes, uh, as I said, the main purpose is to raise money for charity. And that's another reason uh, many companies will take part because of the corporate social responsibility. And another great belief I have is getting people, as you mentioned, out into this beautiful, yeah. beautiful countryside. And I'm so used to doing big solo expeditions, uh, you know, pedalling around the globe, then the Americas, then in teams, things like the Arctic and, uh, and, and the Atlantic. To come back to my training ground, team up with, you know, so many people to take part in these, these, these huge events, you know, I'm pretty excited because despite everything I've done, this is, this is something quite new. Yeah, and we do spoil people as well, they get, you know, they get this fantastic welcoming pasta parties when they arrive on a Friday night and we've got chocolate cake massage, fireworks, uh, the support on route, mountain rescue on the hills, people supporting, it's a wonderful camaraderie, wonderful sort of atmosphere, so you're never alone and uh, there's a lot of fun. You know. The point of being here today is for me to get a sense of, of, of the events, get a bit of training in, uh, a bit of Scottish weather just to make it that little bit more tricky, but come, come events day, what's it normally like? Well, we've been very lucky, I have to say, you know, sort of 80% of the time we get great weather, we can occasionally get the odd wet one, so we do prepare for all weathers, but training's really important, we've got various programs, everybody's at different levels of training, you know, you haven't just got one training program and you can build people up, but anybody can do these events, there's no doubt about that, and often they'll start off on a, on a, on a lower level and come back the next year and do it for maybe a longer yeah. distance, you know, so it's open to everybody. It is, I mean, it's, it's wonderful, the buzz, you know, when people are arriving, the banter going on, they're all excited, a bit nervous, especially about to swim across the lock for the for yeah. and, but they're getting their bikes ready, and it's great, you know, and it's just a wonderful atmosphere, you know, really positive, fun, you know, people are really challenging themselves, you know, and they're raising money for causes, so it's win-win-win. Yeah. Yeah. People uh, see people like myself doing big expeditions in television, and they assume that you're some sort of super athlete, I'll, I'll tell you a secret, I'm really nervous about the swim. That's something which I'm not good at. So 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 for me I I, I think these, uh, these 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 events this year are gonna gonna test me in a very real way. Yeah. 